Holby City is going to leave us with our hearts in our throats tonight when Jack Naylor collapses and is left for dead. Is this the end for the popular character as a distressed Fletch fears that she will die before Jack takes a turn for the worse? She and Fletch have a fierce argument as he is distracted from his work due to the troubles he is having with his daughter. As she delivers some barbed comments his way, Fletch reacts badly and the two friends butt heads. Little does Fletch know that he might not see Jack alive again as she later collapses in her office from a post-operation infection and a question mark hangs over her fate. More, Coronation Street spoilers. All over for Sally and Tim Metcalf as she is jailed viewers will have to wait until the episode next week to find out if she comes through this but it's definitely serious as she is placed into an induced coma. Gaskell and the team fight with everything they have got to save Jack as Fletch anxiously waits for news but will they be a success? Jack does wake up but then scans show she isnt out of danger yet as she has an abscess and needs surgery urgently. As it then emerges that she has sepsis, Gaskell to save her as she faces the prospect of multiple organ failure. With arrow in his mind, Fletch is so distressed at the thought of losing Jack that he breaks down and suffers a panic attack. Will he get the good news that he is hoping for, and how will this change the pair's relationship if she does survive? Holby City continues on Wednesday, the 8th of August at 8 p.m. on BBC One. More, 12 soap spoiler pictures, Emmerdale car crash, Coronation Street death, EastEnders violence, Hollyoaks arrest more, Emmerdale spoilers, Lucy Pargeta reveals unexpected birth episodes for Chas Dingle.